Gino here for the Stencil Girl Creative Team. Today we have a special blog hop going on with Color Craft. Starting out, I'm going to be using some brush o colors in lime green, turquoise, rose red, and white. I dispense some of them in my little color palette and then I spritz with water to create some watercolors. The first stencil I'm working with is called Tropical Twist. I lay the stencil down and then just use a paintbrush and lightly go through the stencil with the brush -os. For the trunk of the palm tree I use the lime green and the rose red mix to make a nice brown. so that I can make a nice flamingo color, like a pale peachy pink. I add a little bit of the rose red to that. To create an even darker, more of a black color for the flamingo feet, I add a little bit of blue to my red and green. Now I'm painting the sky and I'm just adding some blues and reds and just kind of making like a summery colored sky that you might see by the water. Now I'm adding a little bit of the acrylic mist spray in violet. Once I'm done there, I stencil another palm tree on the other side. and just add a little bit of grass at the bottom of my page to kind of tie things together. I add a little bit more of the acrylic mist spray in a lemon color at the top because I want a little bit of like a sun peeking through so I, I need some of that yellow I feel at the, in my sky. Now I'm going to be adding a quote to my page. It says, nature is painting for us day after day pictures of infinite beauty. I glue that on with my Liquitex gel medium. And then I take a black fine marker and just add some accents to make my trees pop a little bit. I use a white Uniball gel pen by Signal to also add some highlights to my page and the coconuts and just to get everything to pop just a little bit more. Give the flamingo a few 
little bit of an outline here and there just to make them stand out a little more on my page. And I go back in and fuss with the sky a little bit more and blend it so that it doesn't look like it's not part of the picture. And our page is complete. Thanks so much everyone for sharing your time with me today. If you like today's tutorial, please leave me a comment or a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. See you guys next time. Bye.